hey, they send to their own haunts. And, uh, um, all right. So yesterday I found out that Halloween Daily News said that there would be a spirit teaser today, which led to a very uh, butt-clenching day because I'm like, is it going to happen or is it not going to happen? It happened. And uh, I haven't watched it. And the reason why is because I was like, okay, if this happens, because last time uh, the names came out and I just decided I'm going to wait or like I'm going to look at them right now. I didn't even think about it, right? Um, but I looked at the names and I was freaking out in class. I was literally like, what's that do? But um, yeah, so that's what I did. Um, and by the time I got home to talk about them, I pretty much lost a bunch of my steam. I was still excited, but I decided to save my reactions for now. I'm gonna film them and analyze and all that good stuff. So it's been a long, a uh, dramatic day at school, honestly. A lot has happened, pretty annoying. But uh, I'm here now with my ghoulies and let's go. So, all right. Without further ado, spirithalloween.com. Okay, enter if you dare, watch now, yeah. Okay, so I know, I know that the guy with the lollipop is in this. I know that Barnaby is in this. I know that there's a reference to Art the Clown, but I don't know if you actually see him. And I'm thinking it's like something terrifying is coming, but somebody's told me that there's uh, like a lot more blank shots than animatronics, but all right, whatever. All right, click. Sorry, that's my dogs. All right, nothing's changed. Fuck, full screen. Welcome. Okay, not, um, not the craziest teaser ever, but, yeah, okay, I'm gonna have to slow this one down, obviously, I'm gonna have to slow this down, but, um, yeah, alright, yeah, I'm gonna go do that right now, alrighty, so I've slowed the teaser down, may look a little janky, like notifications and stuff here and there, I'm just doing this in my editing app, because it's more about my reactions and stuff, but let me give my first, just off the cuff, analysis. So number one we see in this shot, oh, I mean, that's definitely the ringmaster. Like, that's, that's definitely the ringmaster. Looks like a ringmaster, sounds like a ringmaster. We don't see much of him. He looks, he looks okay uh, from what we've seen, just the part of him. Um, yeah, I... I mean, I thought he'd be a ringmaster. Seems he's a ringmaster. Eh, oh, okay. I mean, I'm sure he'll be cool, but, you know. Not too much to say. Okay, there we got a popcorn booth with a little skeleton there. Pretty cool. Hope something like some, I kind of hope something like that's in the theme, because that'll be cool. Okay. Oh, shoot. Okay, that's Barnaby, definitely. Looks a little smaller than I was expecting, but it's... Definitely a bear balancing on a ball. Interesting, though. It looks like he's kind of rocking back and forth. I wonder how that mechanism is going to uh, work. But that's okay. Interested to see how he turns out. Very interested to see. The hands look a little cheap, but... Uh, okay, that is... Okay, I think this would be nibbled. And I've seen this before. I've seen this. And honestly, he looks really good. I mean, I'm not the biggest fan of my SVI clowns. Uh, some can be really good. But the lollipop looks good. I love his color scheme. The face on the side looks really creepy. So, um, yeah, I'm excited. This, this is cool. Okay. Then, oh, oh, shoot. Okay, that's, yeah, I saw that knife, and I definitely thought that was Michael Myers. But that's Michael Myers, and he looks good. Okay. Um, yeah, sorry, that notification is covering the screen, but, yeah, his hand doesn't look too detailed, but everything else looks really detailed. And so I'm hoping he's an okay price. Granted, I don't know if I'd get him, but I hope the mask is good. I really hope that. But that's interesting. I, Michael looks good. Like, really good. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay, this, oh, so this, I assume, is Cotton Candy Dan. 
And it seems he has some kind of jump scare where he pulls, like, a head out of cotton candy. I'm a little nervous because he looks kind of small, like maybe a kid prop, which I'm not the biggest fan of kid props. Kind of like Dagger Mike. But I wonder what he pulls out of the cotton candy. Hoping for, like, a bloody, gory head. It's probably just a skull, really. But that's a fun jump scare. That's, that's a fun concept. I like that. I like that. I like to see what he does. Okay, bloody popcorn on the ground. Not much. In memory of our dear friend, that is definitely Tombstone Ghoul or Greystone Ghoul. I don't know. Uh, the tombstone looks okay. The hands look borderline Sunstar. I was expecting a bad sound light prop, so whatever. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it would be cool, but we'll have to see. Ooh. Oh, okay. This. Ooh. Okay, you can't. Mmm. Okay, you can't make out much of this. Uh, in fact, I can't even tell what it is. It looks like barrels, a sword, a hazmat suit. But this is definitely something to do with giant death ray. Um, and he looks good. Uh, from whatever this is, this is cool. I don't know if that's like a blade at the bottom or... Okay. I'm really interested to see what this guy will be. Yeah. Okay, Monty poster, eh. Tower and Clown, that looks like the original video. So it could just be the original video. It looks a little more high quality and s s different lighting. I don't know. That's interesting, but Tower and Clown, we've seen him, obviously. Oh, what is that? Okay, that's definitely, I'm thinking with the background, this is Max Straw. Can't make out anything about him other than he's floating. It's a little cheap, but, I mean, we can't really see him, so, you know, whatever. Ghost face, that's a ghost face plushie, and a Michael one. Definitely, okay, um, probably part of the ghost face, uh, or at least teasing to ghost face, whatever. We know he's coming. But, honestly, what I'm liking is the background, because if this is, like, along the lines of what we're getting in the ISC... This is, like, great. Like, great carnival aesthetic. Obviously, I'm not the biggest fan of doing a carnival, but I, it looks cool. So, yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, shoot. Okay, okay. This. All right. This picture is definitely, I'd have to say, the cremator. Um... Yeah, because it's holding a burnt-looking burnt skull. I mean, it looks a little cheap. In the, I hope it doesn't sound like I'm being too negative. It looks a little... I don't know, though. Um, it looks like it's probably going to be a Reaper of some kind. Uh, I really hope they do something unique with a face, because just st standard Reapers are starting to get a little eh for me. But if they like have him like a burnt corpse or something, that would be really cool. Looks like his chest lights up with fire, though, so that's 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 interesting. I'm I'm excited to see who Cremator is, or maybe this is Night Terror. I don't know. I'm thinking Cremator, though. All right, and then that is definitely Emily and Victor from Corpse Bride. They look okay. Emily looks kind of small, weirdly enough. Um. Then there's uh, Victor. I I assume with the ring. I kind of thought they'd be one prop, like both of them holding hands or something, but I guess not. They look cool. They actually look pretty good. Um, we can't, don't see their faces, obviously. Um, I haven't seen the corpse right, obviously, but they're cool designs. Nice to see that. All right. And then uh, that is a blurry picture, but I'm pretty sure that's still Giant Death Ray. You can't make out anything from this, so I don't know. Then Art was here, obviously teasing Art the Clown. And, okay. That's interesting. And the, okay, yeah. So Art was here, but in this one, you can see a very opaque picture of him. I'm a little concerned, because he... Um... He... His eyes look really circular, so I don't know what the deal with that is. Maybe it's the glasses. Maybe it comes with the, I don't know. Uh, but I'm, I'm excited to see Art. I'm really excited to see Art. I've heard rumors that he looks bad, but I don't know. 
Um, yeah, I'm really curious what the circles on the eyes are, but he looks interesting. What we can make out. Okay, that's a spinny wheel of death. Um, yeah. And then in front of it, we can see this flash of something. Okay, I don't know what this something is. I don't know if it's a clown. Can't say. Maybe Bobby Strings. I'm thinking maybe this is Night Terror. And if it is, pretty good, I'll say. Uh, obviously, we don't get a very good picture of it, but I i mean, hey, this has the potential to be really cool. In fact, well, in fact it almost reminds me of that teeth mask that I have right behind the camera. Uh, I guess I could pull it out. I don't know. Show you guys. Kind of, if you look close, it kind of reminds me of this, um, which is pretty cool, actually, if it looks something like this. So, yeah. Obviously, I can't confirm this is Night Terror, I don't know, but it's the closest one I can think of. But yeah, that's interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm interested to see. Not quite a Shadow Boogeyman, but he still looks creepy. Alright. Ah, oh, yeah, okay. Alright, anything after that? Mm, other than Welcome to the Carnival. Ooh. Okay, Stilts poster. Another poster in the back. All right, well, that's that. That's the teaser. Um, looking pretty good, I have to admit. I, it, it, this is a pretty good one, because I, uh, you know, it leaves us with enough room for speculation uh, as to what these look like, but it also gives us a little bit, you know? So, yeah, I'm excited. Uh, yeah, I'm really hyped for the art, uh, Night Stalker, whatever he be. Uh, Cremator. Yeah, I mean, these all look, these all look very degrees of cool. But, uh, the Lollipop one, which I think would be Nibbles, looks surprisingly good. Would I get him? Don't really think so, because I don't really like the SVI clowns. Unless he's holding, like, a leg or a child in the other arm, I don't know. Because just a clown with candy is a bit like, eh. But he looks really creepy, like, his face looks great. Uh, Barnaby looks a little questionable. Michael looks really good, surprisingly. I was expecting him to look bad, and granted, we don't know, but this might be the most detailed Michael Myers suit we've seen yet. And so if the mask is good, which I really hope it is. Ooh, hell yeah. And he doesn't really look to be party time, I don't think. I'm thinking maybe techie. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, um, that's that's that. Uh, tell me what you think of the teaser in your, the comments below. Like and subscribe if you're new. Uh, point out any things I might have missed. And I'll see you in the next one.